Purple sticky rice cake is another yol that we love to make in the Hmong culture during this time of year. Especially for my grandma, she would make a lot of it, wrap it in foil, and give it out to our relatives or family members. In the Hmong Lane dialect, we like to call purple sticky rice cake yo mon chang, or like my grandma, she likes to call it ba mon chang. Go back, la ha, ba mon chang. Like any yo recipe, it's basically just pounded sticky rice. But to give this really beautiful purple color, my grandma likes to do a mixture of short grain sticky rice along with some black grain sticky rice. And you let it soak overnight to give it this really nice, beautiful purple color. Good. Once you let it soak, we do steam it and then place it into our mochi pounder and let it pound away. And form it into little round patties and place it in some foil. And this is what it looks like. So as you let it sit in the fridge or overnight, it does harden. And typically in our family, when it comes to leftover nyo, we do like to either grill it, pan fry it, or deep fry. In this case, I'm gonna show you how to deep fry it. It's really, really simple. And this version, we like to call it nyogi. And all you do is simply take any leftover nyo, cut it into strips. And then we're gonna deep fry it in some vegetable oil. Once it's fried, I like to sprinkle it with some salt and enjoy it as it is. So as you can tell, this one, if I crack it open, it's pretty hollow, but it is really crispy. This is my mom's favorite way of eating it. And then this one here is my favorite. It's crispy on the outside, but when you break it in half, it's still nice and chewy and also soft in the center.